we just went live. <laughs> no, no, I'm here. I'm here. Good, good, good. All right. Uh, we are live now for the Power Chat series, the pre-show of the ISKL State Championships. It's going to be a great tournament coming up very soon, guys. So we have the promoters here, um, Tony Hamsani and Keon Pinkney. How are you guys doing today? Doing good. Doing good. Excited about this weekend. How are you doing? Great. So this weekend came up really fast. Um, this The ISKL circuit has been around for some time, and, and this is sort of the culmination, right, of a great season. How are you guys feeling ahead of it? Well, this is the last tournament of, the, of our season. We are very, very excited for this. We have an amazing year, a very good competition, amazing school, nice, uh, a, a high level of competition, and this is the right way to finish our season. All right. All right. Keon, you're you're helping also with putting this tournament together so it you know runs well and people have a good customer experience. How's that going? It actually it, it went really well this year. You know, for uh for it being our first year this year, you know, you always start something new, you know, you're a little nervous about it, but you know, everything every I feel like everything went went, went, went really well for our first year. And you know, and like like you say, every year it's gonna get better and better, baby. Okay, great. Um, I think he dropped off for a second, but all right. So Tony, oh, he's back in. But Tony, we've got some feature divisions I see here on the flyer. What are some of those, and you know, why should people be excited for it? Yes, we are. We are competing in multiple divisions. We have weapons, extreme, traditional. We have uh, traditional forms, creative forms, extreme forms, and in fighting, we have team fighting, under belt team fighting, that will be a new division in our tournament. And also we'll have point fighting and continuous fighting. People can compete in more than, than 10 divisions. Right. Wow, 10 divisions. Now, um, in terms of the judging situation, you guys are gonna be equipped so people um, have good qualified judges? That's very yes. important, absolutely. We're gonna have some uh, good qualified judges, you know, Definitely moving around, you know, make sure they see the, see the correct points, you know, uh, absolutely. There's going to be some. And we are continuously training then. We have a lot of certification during the year and we have our staff. We are not improvising with judges and they are ready to do their job in the tournament. Okay. And so for people who don't understand, um, this is the state championship. This is the last, the last tournament of the season. Did you need to get a certain number of points to be able to compete. Can just anyone yeah, it, compete? No, everybody can compete, but this is the last tournament, the most important that everybody come. And if they need some points to be first in their division, they need to be here. All right, okay. And and the, ultimately this is the bragging rights for the 2023 season. Um, at, you've gotten to be able to watch a number of tournaments, a number of competitors. How have you seen these competitors grow this year? Yeah, well, we start with 100 competitors in our first tournament, and in our last, in the last tournament, we have more than 250. And uh, in Florida, we have a lot of schools, and people like to compete a lot, and they compete in different leagues. But the most important thing here is the high level of competition that we have in, in Central Florida. Okay, and now I'm sure at the front of people's mind, though, um, with just the current events of Hurricane Idal Idalia, um, are are you the, is it still a green light to go in terms of what people should expect? Yes, uh, the storm uh, apparently will come tomorrow, but they don't touch us really hard. Good. We will have Good. a lot of wind and raining, but only tomorrow. And we expect that Thursday everything go normally. Also, the schools, uh, regular schools, only close tomorrow for safety. But I think the tournament will be run normally on Saturday. Okay. All right. That's good reassurance. All right. So as yes. we wait for Creon to come back in here, um, he's gonna he he dropped out, but he's gonna try to come back, um, rejoin us. Let's show some of the cups. Nice, beautiful yeah. awards, right? Beautiful awards. In our league, we try to have an amazing award for the competitors. Uh, they deserve that. And we are providing cups in all the divisions. First, second, and third place, they, the winners will we have cups. And also, we have medals for all the, the finalists in the, in the 
beginner's division. Beautiful. All right, we've got Kayon back in here um, to chat more. Awesome, great, excited to have you back. Okay, now we've passed the pre-registration deadline, right? No, 26. Yes. Ah, uh, yes, we did. But tell everybody, still possible to register. They still can get their competition on, right? Tell us how to do that, Kayon. Yeah. Yes. Okay, Kim. Go ahead, Mr. Go ahead, go ahead, Mr. Tony. Okay. Okay. Uh, people can go to Human Text, uh, Price Rise, but we are supporting all the schools. If they need a discount code, call us. Uh, we want to support everybody, and we want that everybody come, and we can help them with that. But only we, we, they, they can pay uh, one amount for two divisions, and the, the additional division will be another amount, but it will be is is cheaper amount. Ken, you sound really excited about this tournament. Um, looks like you're somewhere at a gym or something. Um, tell me more just about, you know, bringing your background of martial arts into this tournament and how the circuit has um, kind of supported you or your students um, in your training. Oh, with that being so, you know, I've, I've been in a karate industry since for a big, you know, uh, when you my dad, uh, Grandmaster Earl Harris, a Hall of Famer of, uh, of Florida. So, you know, when I went to the state of Florida, for my dad, you know, take first, first place there, uh, you know, it's good you know, to be for this, that, that post. Hey, Keon, give me one second. I don't, I don't mean to interrupt you. I've got okay. most of what you're saying, but I think um, with the phone, the speaker's at the bottom. And so the speaker, why don't you flip it? And I think I'll be able to hear you a little bit better. Or just hold the camera. Yeah. Okay, I'll just hold it. Oh, gosh. Oh. <laughs> I know. It's always a technical problem. It's okay, though. But yeah. Um, well, okay. Isabella, also, we will have a, a gift cards for all the grand champions. We Great. have a 25 bucks. A gift card for all the grants, uh, 9 and under, 10 and 11, 12, 30, 14, 15, 16 to 17. All juniors can win a, a grand champion cup that is different of those. And also they will, they, they can win a gift card. Awesome. So, you know, more incentive to go. At Keon, you were mentioning your father was a, a Hall of Famer and as a martial artist? Yes, ma'am. Grandmaster Earl Harris, you know right here in Brandon, Florida. And like I said, man, you know, he's one, how I learned how to kick, punch, and do all the above. And we, we uh, went around the state of Florida back when it was fame, you know, uh, shout out to Mike Smith, you know, uh, all the, uh, I don't want to say old people, but okay, let's say original gangsters, you know? <laughs> so back at fame, you know, competed back in fame, you know, also, uh, uh, Mr. Manny Rez, which is a great man, great, great person. I still see around and, you know, just competed around and, you know, did my thing. And like I said, now I'm very happy to be a part to uh, be one of the people that are that's that's hosting the tournaments and, uh, you know, uh, making it run the way we wanted to run. And, you know, things that we saw in the past that we want to change and, you know, just make our circuit better and grow our circuit, you know. And it's been and like I said, it's been going very, very well. And we're gonna, and we want to end it with a bang, baby. We want to end it with a bang this Saturday, even though we, we got we got the hurricane going on right now. You know, I'm sitting in my studio is raining outside. We're getting the outer bands here, but we still should be we should be okay uh, for Saturday. You know. Oh, yeah, that's what that's what Tony was saying. Um, you know, it's expected you're on the sort of the outskirts of where the, the hurricane's supposed to be. Um, and so it's still going to be a great time to, to come out. I see the location is at the family church on the Windenmere campus. Um, the yes. location is on the flyer. Uh, I'm assuming it'll be a great spot. But if anybody has any questions, those numbers at the bottom of the screen, they can reach yes. out. Yes, yes, yes. Everybody invited. And this is a nice place. Uh, the location is really nice. It's an old town, beautiful town. After the tournament, you can walk. It's a beautiful place. Great. There'll be a team fight, two to two man team fights going on. I'm very, very excited about that. You know, be some great yeah. competition. People gonna be yelling, screaming. You know, just the atmosphere at our tournaments is like, like it's. I, I haven't seen it anywhere else. And I've been to some good, some great tournaments, but. It's just like, you know, the vibe, the vibe that we bring, 
it's amazing. It's amazing. We have, we definitely have great customer service. You know, we're here to. This what we got. Uh, you know, um, I did, um, I did so much tournament, and, and we get nothing but you know great feedback. So I'm, I'm definitely for baby. Team, team fights is going to be a really fun one to watch. I know that for sure. I mean, it's at any tournament, really, but especially down in Florida. Um, I think there's such an established crew of fighters down there that I think they just want to prove their dominance, right? And ISKL is a great place to do that, given the you know quality of fighters there. Yeah. Tony, um, you have a lot of students in your school who are amazing competitors. How are they feeling for ISKL and also you as a coach? Oh, they are ready. They are ready. They are doing they, their own things. Hey, I will do team with this. I will do team with this. <laughs> and they have a, an internal competition too. You know, I have. I bet. Because we have teams in all the division. We have nine and under, two fighters. Any mm -hmm. bell. Uh, nine and under, females. 10 and 11, boys. 10 and 11, girls. And they are doing their the, the own teams. I have my team with that guy. I have my team with that guy. Okay, let's do it. And that, that would be amazing, you know, because in big tournaments, they we have only team fighting of black belts. Yeah. When, 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 they, when they have the opportunity to do their own teams with other belts, people is really excited. Also the parents. Yeah, that's so great. Um, okay, great. And so as we wrap up, I want to wait for Keon to come back in, um, rejoin us here. Um, but tell me a little bit more about some of the Final lessons you've learned in this ISKL circuit this year, and um, any any lessons going into next year? Yes, well, we are learning. This is our this is our first year, and we learn a lot. Uh, we learn a, a lot of, of our customers what they want, what what that was they want, or they like it too much. What divisions works and what divisions are more exciting for the for the people what we need to bring to next year and uh, what schools we need to invite to and a lot of things we're learning every day we're learning how 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 we need to train the judges how how we can certif certif certificate the judges what tools they need to use to be best judges a lot of things we are implementing this year and next year too to always be improving is to always learn and get feedback, right? Yes, yes, yes. And it's very good. We have feedback from the parents. We have feedback from, from the, the school teachers. We have feedback for the competitors. And also, I am trying to learn from all the leagues, you know? If you saw something in an old league and that thing's working, that, that thing helped to the, run the tournament better, that thing is better for the judges. I need to implement that because this is best not only for our league, it's best for all the customers. Awesome, awesome. Okay, well, I'm not sure we'll get Keon back by the time we wrap up, but to hit the high points, make sure you get out September 2nd, the ISKL State Championships, prove your dominance for the year of 2023 and wrap yes. up the season on this circuit. All right, Tony, thank you so much for coming on the Power yeah. Chat series. Thank you, senor. Thank you so much, Isabella. And guys, don't forget it. This weekend, September 2nd, here in Windermere, the ISKL State Champion. Any question, please call me. Yes. Easy to access, Tony. You're, you know, you got the phone numbers right there and the emails right there. So everybody, yes. thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Yes. Thank you so much, Isabella. Okay.